but the foundation of what makes people feel unfulfilled, unhappy, or stuck in their life, not taking action, boils down to the same things. There's a core issue. And that core issue, somewhere between the ages of three to five, something happened that shattered your world and the way that you perceive yourself, and suddenly things are unsafe, you're not okay, um, you're not good enough, you're unworthy, and you start to filter your whole entire life through that lens. It happens unconsciously. It's like a survival mechanism, it right? It is, yeah, yeah, because that wound becomes so deep and then you believe it to be true. And it's important to note that you see what you believe. And so as long as you have a belief system that you feel that you're undeserving, inadequate, or not good enough, whatever that case mm -hmm. may be, you're gonna continue to filter the way that you go into an environment, the way that you interact with friend groups or circles, the way that you interact with, you, with teachers or mentors or whatever it is in your life, and you're going to have that filtered seed. Now that's gonna cause this paralysis of this true heart's desire to manifest. It's gonna cause you to do things that maybe you don't wanna do because you're seeking approval or worth. And as a result, you have a slightly unfulfilled or undesirable life, right? And that can be become greatly unfulfilled and undesirable and create like massive destruction in your life or it can be the subtle like, you know, this. And that then, turns into this inability to take action in one's life. Most people spend too much time looking from the outside world into their into how they're they're being perceived instead of from their eyes going out into the world. And in that it stops them. They might think that they're too old or too young or too this or too that to try different things. It doesn't matter where you're at. It doesn't matter if you never have uh, studied or did this one thing, you know, you can learn it. You have the ability to learn. And when you stop worrying about the judgment and you just get into the excitement of that new thing, you can bounce in and dive into a whole bunch of different things. And I think, you know, so I, I maybe I do too much because I'm so overwhelmed by like the excitement. So, you know, I dive into real estate or I dive into <laughs> film and, and then, and then I'm, you know, I have a couple scripts that I've wrote and then I have this like a book and then I like have the stores and a tech company and then I'm doing this or that, you know, and I'm like all over. And I'm like, maybe I'm gonna open a restaurant next. And I'm like, you know, it's, it's, but why not? Why not? 